This is the visualization for changing direction. Find a comfortable place to sit down or lie down. Close your eyes and begin to focus on your breath in and out of your nose. You have chosen this visualization because there is an area in your life where you lack satisfaction, happiness or peace. One of the biggest traps when we desire change is like a pinball. We run from one side to the other, demonizing our current reality and choosing its opposite, hoping that it will bring happiness, satisfaction, and peace. But the greatest shifts in direction are very subtle. The drama of our ego desires a sweeping grand gesture of change, a choosing of the opposite so as to ensure we do not attract the same thing. We have the energy of rejection for the old reality. And with that active rejection, we miss the lessons and the blessings and the new wisdom and perspective that we can harness if we surrender resistance to the old. Instead of being in rejection of the current reality you are dealing with, be curious as to what aspects of it do work and the finite specifics that don't. This way you will find a shift rather than fall prey to the trap of resistance. Now, with the wisdom of the body, we'll examine the old and look towards the new. The wisdom of our bodies has such a vast perspective and clear direction to guide us from what is not serving us to what truly can. Starting with the crown of the head and scanning the body all the way down to the toes, think about the old reality and what you choose to move away from. Get specific. Where do you feel it in your body? Where do you feel the resistance living? Is it anger towards something that happened or was said? A disappointment, something that wasn't realized? An expectation you had that was not met? Note where you feel this in your body. And your body will tell you what desire or need you had that was not met. Give voice to that desire. Is it the desire to be cared for? Security? To be seen, loved, appreciated? Feel purposeful? To get justice, to feel at peace. Allow the wisdom of your body to show you where that frustration has been living in your jaw, in your stomach, in your head, through your thoughts. And allow the breath to continually come in while you're doing this to keep a sense of detachment from that resistance, just like a scientist in observation of an experiment. 
Keep a healthy detachment as you explore. What aspects specifically haven't worked? And what has worked? What has been fulfilling or good or peaceful? What have you been learning? If it hasn't been peaceful, how have you grown, gotten stronger, gained a new perspective? Breathe into your heart. Can you be gratitude? Saturating the body with that energy. Be gratitude from head to toe, exuding this energy towards this experience. Sometimes the things we can be most grateful for are the things that have steered us back on to the track where our soul truly desires to go. We will never know what we truly desire until we understand what we do not desire. Feel that gratitude in every cell of your body. Be that gratitude with your thought. As you hold this old reality in your heart, And feel the frustration too. That is that masculine energy of focus, that fiery element that will help you change direction and blaze a new course. But if you react and reject the old reality, you'll miss the higher seeing place of the divine feminine, the perspective, the wisdom, the dance, to uncover aspects into the desire of this new reality that you didn't even know you desired. What aspects of the old would you carry into the new, even if it's a simple awareness? Keep breathing. Listen to your physical body. Visualize this new direction, not as a complete opposite of the old, but a completely different dimension where you extract the brilliance and the lessons of the old, allowing them to empower you as you move forward. In this new direction, who's around you? Who is supporting you? feeding you, allowing and encouraging your expansion, your success, your radiance. Surrender all judgment of the old, drop it, allowing deep trust that the universe will bring justice, that God will provide the balance that is in nature. Everyone is learning lessons. Everyone has blind spots. Everyone is navigating their own karma to understand what next they need to learn, what their soul is here to experience. Drop all focus on others or injustices behind you like dropping a heavy weight off your shoulders, letting it fall where it may and stepping forward. Listen to the guiding force of your intuition and divine nudges from higher guidance. Let your body move towards joy and pleasure. Things that you want to experience and create and feel the joy of that privilege to manifest something new. Feel the peace flood your heart as you deepen your breath and you slowly open your eyes, trusting in this new direction.